The Mays Landing Golf Club is, uh, we like to consider a very affordable golf course. Uh, nice thing about Mays Landing is here, you can bring the whole family and still have money left over to go out to dinner that night. And that's the way it's been since 1962, when owner and designer Leo Frazier introduced it. And the Frazier family is still in charge. So, you know that Mays Landing is one of the best values at the beach. What it isn't is modern or manufactured. This is golf pure and as simple as you want. The thing I like most about Mays Landing is it rewards the really good golfer, but it doesn't penalize the bad golfer. Example, if you look around, the woods here are all cleared out. Okay, so if your ball's in the woods, you can find it without any trouble, and the better player has a chance of getting the ball from the woods to the green and without losing shots. You can have a combination of some long par fours, some short par fours, where you basically have to play golf. You have to manage your game. You're going to use every club in your bag. There are four sets of tees from which to choose that take the course from 5,300 to 6,600 yards, with the finishing holes among the longest and most challenging in the area. Affordable, natural, challenging, and Mays Landing has history on its side, too. We are probably one of the oldest clubs in here, and basically, if you get a chance, go looking at our wall. One of our past club champions was Jimmy Dent, the long driving champ, and Jimmy really made it famous on the tour, on the senior tour. We have a huge selection of courses right now. You can get your Lynx design courses. You can get some courses that are a little bit tougher than tough, and you can get your courses like Mays Landing, where you can come out and have a good time and enjoy yourself. And the 18 handicap's not gonna shoot 120.